Hello, my soccer universe, and welcome to part five of my Champions League jersey review. Today, we will be looking at Group E, and similar to part four, I'm putting the thumbnail of the top seven team and I'm wearing the jersey of uh, another team that I have. In this case, it's Napoli, um, which, as you will see, this is how to me a Napoli jersey should look like, except for. This letter sponsor, this was the 1617 um, Champions League home jersey. That was very good time to this jersey wise, not necessarily performance wise. But we'll not start in Napoli, we'll go alphabetically in this group. We have Genk, we have Liverpool, we have Napoli, we have Salzburg, and that's how I'm ordered them alphabetically. So let's start with the Belgian champions who are supplied by Nike in a template that I've seen also with um, young boys and it reminds me very much of the 2002 Nike template that the Juve Brazil used at the World Cup. You know, you have a triangle here, you have it down there. They don't go full out as it was back then. It still is a weird one. And I have to say this picture also is kind of, they use the template and then don't even adjust for the angle and put the uh, logos on there. So uh, that picture looks weird in any way. Uh, it's not an exciting jersey. I think it's rather average in the template. doesn't make it endearing to me as well. So for that reason, I would only give this four stars. Um, say, same I can say for the away jersey, which is even a tad worse because the sponsor is in purple. Make the sponsor in blue. Don't be such such a D-I-C-K uh, and force another color on there, especially a color that is so associated with uh, one other team in Belgium. Um, actually, for that reason, I will drop this down to three stars only. And I'm sorry, I mean, the third jersey looks a tad bit better. But then again, the sponsor and the colors don't quite fit. Um, Again, we have grey, we have a very, very light green bordering uh, yellow already. It's a little bit like puke also. Um, I like the template better, but I don't necessarily like the jersey better for that reason. I'm also, the colors are off. The template is okay, uh, but the colors are completely off uh, for that reason. I'm not even going to go two stars here because it's just way too colorful, especially with the bank sponsor. Spending not much time on this one, but uh, there's not much to talk about except that things are not connecting for me. Different story for Liverpool, the home jersey. I really like the classic look, and again, I said it right in my Premier League jersey review, I'm not so sold on the way the jersey is presented by New Balance. Um, it just looks a little bit too boxy, too weird in, in a way. It doesn't look like there's a human uh, <laughs> behind that. Especially the color the looks weird, but uh, if you see that match, uh, the jersey in the match, really nice looking. Maybe the weird cutter like uh, white uh, band here is is a little bit odd. Also, that the pinstriping, which I do like, is not going over the entire jersey. I think that would have sent this one over the top for me. But it's a really nice one. I actually I'm wanna say although it adds another color but sponsor in white and everything else in golden that's a really good look for liverpool i gave this eight stars i'm gonna stick with that just because there are just a few tiny details to just but it's a really nice look jersey but i like the one last season uh, just a teeny bit better the away jersey in white i think i find useful i'm just not so sold on this sound wave zigzaggy pattern on there also i know it has been used before but i'm not so sold on the navy as a liverpool color i actually think black could look better but it's a very useful very decent looking um away jersey i like that there's a little bit red on there I know it has rarely been done, but I would like to have my Liverpool away kits uh, in white with red. Makes sense. But that's me. That's me. Seven stars for this one. 
It's the third jersey that absolutely kill, kills me. I have a colleague who actually likes this one because he likes the color combination for me. This is not Liverpool. And what's this pattern on there? I mean, this looks like... Oh, not, do you, do you uh, remember these 3D pictures where you had to kind of squint and you see some object? That's what this reminds me of. I don't like the colors. I don't like the pattern. I mean, the colors are not Liverpool. Put me some, give me some red. Make a black jersey. Make some red on there. Then we can talk and get rid of the pattern. Then it's a boring jersey, but it will look miles better than this one. Honestly, two stars only for that one. Now we get to Napoli, who once more released a special Champions League jersey, but this time around it's again based on the home jersey. But they didn't add crazy colors. Like here we have some gold. Uh, last season they had last season they had some neon uh, lining somewhere uh, going. Um, now, instead of the white shoulders, you get a navy shoulder, and also here on the side. We still have this weird camouflage pattern on the front. We have only one sponsor, which is always an, an improvement. I gotta say, it's still not a Napoli look. This is a Napoli look. I think still it's a little bit too dark, but it looks much better than the home jersey. I have to say this. Uh, when I saw image, this is much, much better, much more like it. I still not super crazy about it also gotta say that but I think I'm willing to give this six stars because I, 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 it really is a better look and more in tone I, I really don't like the white for some reason this one looks more crazy what would I do better yeah change the navy and use this slightly darker um, blue as your accent then I think we have a really nice jersey Really nice jersey, not cup up and this away jersey, yes, and for the championship, like the, uh, the MSC logo would be gone. I don't like this uh, dark green stuff. I mean, this is a military kit, and I don't know why, 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 why they're doing it. You don't need a camouflage. I don't like green as a soccer jersey unless it's a traditional color. You don't need this camouflage look. You want to hide on the pitch? That's the worst thing you, you all can say to a player. Three stars, I'm not going to discuss this more. Much better is the away jersey. I really like this one too. And there you see some things done right. I mean, I really like the light blue shoulders and the white. This looks like an applicate again. MSC will be gone for the Champions League. And here I actually like a little bit navy accents. It's maybe a little bit too colorful for an applicate. I mean, if it's only used one accent color, namely the light blue, it would be better. But this is still a decent jersey and I would give it the six stars that I've given in the uh, Serie A jersey review. Now to the last team, which is Salzburg, and here I will do that. What I've usually, what what I said before, if a team has dedicated league and dedicated Champions League jerseys, I will look at both of these because this is not a team from the top five leagues, and so we're gonna look at Salzburg, the home jersey for the league first. Which adds a new look, but I have to say it's not an uninteresting one. You have red and white stripes. I mean, usually Salzburg home jersey was a white with some small red accents here. Now it's a little bit more red. Uh, is a look that I would like to see very often. Maybe I think it makes an overall nice look. Note that there's a star now over the crest. This is not the crest we'll see in Europe as we will see in a bit. Uh, but it fits with the Red Bull branding. As I said, maybe a little bit more red than previously. But I think it's a good look and I would give this seven stars. For the Champions League, we first adjust the logo to be not too similar to Leipzig and all that kind of, kind of stuff. And we just take a plain red shirt with a slightly lighter sleeves. And Salzburg has been doing that, it's especially for Europe, they kind of issue boring jerseys. Last year the European jersey looked good, it was also a purely red, red one, but this one is a little bit too boring to me. It's not bad, it's a clean look. But it's also not exciting to me and for that reason only five stars. The away jersey in the league, and I've seen this now across Salzburg, um, adds an interesting color scheme with the, again the Red Bull color scheme with the navy and the yellow which looks nice. I just don't like the red on there. Although it is another color if you look at the crest I mean it just adds the two other colors. But I never get, I never got the Red Bull away colors. Uh, for that reason, yes, it's interesting. I overall can find some liking to it as much as I can like a Salzburg jersey. 
um, but it's not my favorite one and I only want to give this five stars it's just a tad too colorful to be honest and the away jersey for Salzburg in the Champions League take the home jersey make it black and I wonder if they will be able to wear uh, this one at Liverpool proper where they will be but it will look weirdish I would assume but probably at Liverpool they will wear uh, this black one uh, doesn't look bad again nothing exciting maybe even too monochromatic uh, but it's also not a bad one I don't understand the light the sleeves but okay it's team wear with Red Bull put over I would expect something a little bit more exciting for Salzburg to be honest when we look at Leipzig they get exciting Salzburg should get a little bit like that as well but then again yeah that's what they do they want they are not spending as much effort on Salzburg which the Salzburg fans are not very happy that's why they were so happy when last year Salzburg beat Leipzig twice to kind of show who's actually the original Red Bull team don't get me started on Red Red Bull but yeah five stars for this one as well it's not exciting but it's also not a really bad jersey that's it, I went a little bit faster through this because we've seen many of these jerseys and the other jerseys are not much to talk about. So um, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, please drop a comment below and tell, let me know what you think about this jersey. I really would like to hear your opinion on these as well, whether you agree or disagree with me, all opinions are valid here. And yeah, subscribe to my channel if you want to stay updated for the next jersey reviews. I'm for sure going to do an Europa League jersey review and I will do a Liga jersey review, I want to keep this going. But, you know, give me time, by the end of October, mid-November, we will be done with all those jersey reviews and then we'll look at which jerseys I did overall like best. I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos or playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated with all things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day. Bye.